Dave Kropinski here with Hoop Group. I'm sitting alongside Spencer Weiss. We're at Academic League Camp at Albright College. Uh, Spencer, what are your overall thoughts on the Academic League Camp so far? Uh, so far it's been great. Uh, you know, the drills in the morning get you going. A lot of skill work, uh, proves your game that you could use in the games later on in the day. And, uh, you know, my team has been, you know, fortunate enough to be in some pretty competitive games, so it gets pretty uh, pretty live at the end. Uh, we had a close, two close games so far, um, and, yeah, it's just been enjoyable. Now, something about academic league camp that people maybe don't know is you do a lot of stuff off the court, too. Tell me about some of the, some of the lectures, uh, you know, the College Pursuit Lecture, Fran Fischilla, you know, some of the stuff like that. Yeah, the, uh, lec the lecture uh, yesterday was really great. Um, it got you talk. It got us, uh, you know, learning about how to apply to colleges, which colleges to choose, and how to narrow it down. So, you know, with being a rising senior, that's something you know I'm going to have to put to put to use in the next couple months to uh, find the college that I'm looking for. And uh, you know, Fran Pichello was great. You know, I was able to be one of the kids that you know got to work out with the drills, and you know, it got to show some of our weaknesses and uh, what we have to improve on. Some some drills that we probably wouldn't see normally. And uh, you know, he being the guru that he is, he. He showed us some great drills that uh, I'll go home and work on. Now, over the past couple of years, you really dedicated yourself to basketball. You're a baseball player, kind of growing up in middle school and stuff like that. You know, now it's it's purely basketball. You said AAU basketball is a, a year-round thing now. Uh, you know, what does that do for you as a player now? Kind of dedicating yourself year-round to playing basketball. Uh, well, now that uh, you know, I'm just solely focused on basketball. I'm able to really work on my game and uh, again the weight room more often. Um, I feel that. You know, being, you know, 6'5 and having some, uh, you know, my bones, I feel that, you know, once I have that first step, I can use my body to, you know, get to the rim and make plays for other teammates. So just, you know, fully dedicating myself to the process uh, and basketball, it's just, it's enabled me to uh, improve my game overall. I kind of in the spring circuit, you know, a lot of coaches maybe didn't know who you were. Um, you know, how is your recruitment kind of developing now? Uh, right now, it's, you know, it's going great. Um, I have seven offers, uh, a lot of other schools are interested. Um, I feel at uh, Pitt Jam Fest, I uh, really shot, shot well, and uh, coaches took notice, and you know, I'm just looking forward to you know, show them my game over you know, the July live period, and uh, get some more interest in tomorrow. Now for some of the people that haven't seen you play, uh, describe your game a little bit. Uh, I guess you know, people like to call me a tweener, but I just like to consider myself a basketball player. Um, I'll try to do a little bit of everything on the floor, uh, get my teammates involved, you know, hit the shots, drop the basket if I have a guy I can beat to the, you know, to the rim. So I'm just an overall uh, basketball player, I like to call myself. Shooting is probably a staple of your game, but overall you're, you can do a lot more than that. Um, going into the summer now, you're going to be heading to some camps and tournaments like that. Any kind of goals that you have for over the summer? Uh, just show yeah, no regrets. I have no regrets. So um, just show coaches my game. You know, don't go outside of my game, but. Uh, you know, stay within the confines of my game, and I feel like I'll be uh, in pretty good shape in the end. Now, fast forwarding a lot, way past summer, now high school season, your uh, AU teammate, Wade Baldwin, is going to be uh, playing at St. Clair's Kentucky. Hey, are you looking forward to him coming out to Seton Hall Prep and, uh, and playing the guys? Yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, him, Carl Town, both sports you guys, so we want another shot at them. They beat us twice this past year, but, you know, um, they won't, they'll, be blood, they'll be bloodshed during that game, I promise you that. A, l a little, you know, behind the scenes action here. Wade's actually behind the camera right now. He's, he's smiling back there about that. All right, well, thanks a lot, Spencer. Uh, for more interviews like this, you can go to hoopgroup.com. Follow us on Twitter at the Hoop Group. Spencer, you're on Twitter. Where can other people follow you at? Uh, S underscore Weiss, W-E-I-S-Z, 973. All right. Thank you very much.